What's good, future millionaires? We back with another banger. I'm December DeMarco, Fortune 500 marketer, here to share my insights of the market with y'all to hopefully help y'all become better informed investors, man. Salute to y'all for pulling up on the channel. Make sure you hit that thumbs up like button for the YouTube algorithm. So we got an update. Also, make sure you pull up to class. Our last two classes have been extremely successful. We're going over economic indicators and how they apply to the market and how you can use this information to become a better informed investors. The first class, we had over 900 and about 50 students show up. Second class so far, around 800 students showed up. So, you know, it's, it's picking up, man. You know, you want to make sure if y'all serious about investing, y'all tap in. Now, we got Shatoshi Kasuma letting us know now is the best time to burn or buy Shiba Inu. So, uh, here's an article from Gfinity Esports. So, the bear market presents the best time to buy or burn Shiba Inu, according to the SHI project lead developer, Shatoshi Kasuma. With Shiba Inu price having fallen hard in the last few weeks, Shatoshi told his Twitter followers to take advantage of the dip to burn Shiba or increase their holdings. Here's a closer look at what he said. Bear market opportunities for Shiba. In a Twitter thread, Shatoshi Kasuma first praised Shiba Inu's holders' resilience through these market conditions. I know the market conditions are tough, but it's amazing to see how Shiba Army Strong is so true, he said. He then announced on the opportunities of the crash sheep prices. During this bear market is the best opportunity for anyone to buy sheep or burn sheep, Shatoshi said. Ryoshi would say this, that the number doesn't always go up and that it wasn't a bad thing. So here's that uh, tweet right there. This is a common idea in the cryptocurrency market. Holders will boast about buying at discount during crypto crashes, expecting the price to go back up. A Shiba Inu recovery does seem to be starting, with Shiba rising 4% in 24 hours as the general crypto recovery continues. Shiba holders have already spoken about the huge opportunity the dip provides for sheep burns. Now that a more official statement from Shatoshi has endorsed such burning opportunities, those in the burning community may hope to see the burn rate increase. On June 18th, 366 million sheep was burned, up from 110 million sheep from the previous day. Aside from buying and burning, uh, Shatoshi also teased holders about upcoming projects. Things are moving well on all fronts, he said. Over the next few weeks, you will begin to see things we've been working on come to fruition. Shatoshi did not say what these things are, also noting the existence of NDAs. There are a lot of there are lots that sheep holders can speculate on, however, whether Shibirim or a Red Bull and Shiba Inu collaboration. Remember, those were two major, you know, things that we talked about, and either one of those things would be very good. You know, uh, Shibirim would be exciting, you know, and also be the beginning of, you know, us having our own blockchain and all the things to come that will be built on that. And a Red Bull partnership will potentially open up a lot of, you know, bigger brand deals or bigger companies putting the eye on Shiba Inu and taking us more serious. So excited about any one of those options. So I just want to keep y'all updated on that. Let's take a quick look, see what the price is right now. We are at the 8116 level. Let's go in a little closer on the four hour chart. So right in this range, let me make a box around here. So right in this range is where you definitely want to be scooping Shiba Inu.
Okay, so if we take a look in the at the range at the bottom of the downtrend where the green candles or the bullish candles begin to change where everything turns around. So right in this range here, right around this uh in this six nine ish to around uh around a seven two seven range, just in that general area right there, seven one five ish or right at the high sixes in that range that was an extreme buying opportunity and we're seeing the people who bought in that time frame using that demand zone you know we're seeing it pay off for them right now and you know remember a lot of people are traders they're not long-term investors so they're just trying to buy at a very low price and sell it for a higher price doesn't uh really you know Sometimes they're not going to get the certain percentage that they're looking for when they enter the trade, but as long as they make some profits, that's all they're looking for. They're going to buy it low and sell it at the next resistance levels. So look for those supply and demand zones. I'll do a, a recap video. I got videos teaching y'all supply and demand zones, how to spot those. And, you know, just look for those levels to be able to, you know, try to predict where people will jump in on the chart and where they'll begin to take profit at. So, uh... That's all we pretty much got for this video. I got uh we got another class coming up today, so make sure y'all got notifications on so that way y'all can, you know, learn these economic indicators. Also, I have another video coming up uh talking about some community, you know, inspired things that are coming to uh the sheep ecosystem and how, you know, we all can basically do our part to help, you know, push this mission forward. So if you're looking at trying to burn sheep right now is a very good time because you can burn more of the supply for a cheaper price. And if you're looking to buy sheep or increase your position size, then it's definitely a good time because you're basically getting in at prices that, you know, we haven't seen for a while now. So appreciate y'all for pulling up. Drop a comment. Let me know that y'all rocking with me. And that's all we got. And we are out.